Hello everyone, my name is Aiman Maulana from Portudana and today I'm giving the MacBook Pro M4 camera a try because I've heard that the front camera has gotten an improvement. Now, at least from what I can see, I think it captures my face pretty well. I think given that I'm only using that room lighting, I don't have any studio lighting of any kind, and you can kind of see the over the back there, the light is off. So there's only one lighting source which is on the ceiling over, well, this direction. So, yep, yeah, this way. So there's that and on the MacBook Pro itself there are a number of features that you can use to make the video look better whether it's on a video call or if you're doing something similar in this way you're trying to record yourself in front of the camera so first things first let me try center stage so you can see the camera zoomed in a little bit and now it's trying to track my face wherever I go so if I move so it moves accordingly with me so see I move the other side there you go okay so that's center stage let me just disable that for a bit so portrait so here it gives that blurred background look that a lot of people like from uh, DSLR cameras and also smartphones these days so let's disable that next up we have studio light so yeah it kind of makes my face look like better lit in the sense again it's not gonna beat having actual lighting but if you just don't really have much of an option this does help to some degree yep there you go uh, there are some reactions i believe you can give yourself some emotes of some kind yeah there you go <laughs> there's that it's not limited just that there's a whole bunch you can use although if you're asking me to just feel a little bit a little bit obnoxious but yeah i mean to each their own and of course i think a lot of people have been using this back in the pandemic just changing your background I think it works well enough it's just looking a little bit jagged when I move yeah otherwise if I'm not moving it looks perfectly fine but yeah of course the how to say the better you are being lit up the better this will work so if you're in a dark room this is not gonna work well in fact I wouldn't be surprised with the background that you're that you chose actually goes on to you as well whether it's in your entirety or maybe some bits and pieces like your clothing for example so yeah so personally yeah let me do that you know, let me just put it on center stage personally i kind of like this because it does show a good improvement over the predecessor i think the camera works well enough on its own but generally for people who want to use this for a video call this is definitely more than enough and as you can tell this audio like where my voice comes from the microphone that the macbook pro m4 has records audio very clearly like to me it feels like near studio quality like as if you're using like a standalone condenser mic but obviously it will capture the environmental noise like more so yeah just be careful that don't use it in a noisy room just try to find somewhere quieter i think fan noise is still fine because i'm pretty sure it is it doesn't capture my ceiling fan right now you can't see the fan but i think you can see the shadow yeah you can see the shadow over here <laughs> yeah so the fan is on so i don't think you can hear it but at the same time just in case you also might not want to oh it just went up you might also not want to turn on the fan to blow directly into the macbook pro just in case just to avoid noise now there is isolation mode i don't know if that helps uh just do keep in mind especially when it comes to like these kind of software solutions like designed to kill off like background noise and focus more on your voice the louder the background noise is the more affected the quality of your audio recording comes like your voice so if it starts to sound a little bit muffled yeah that's the software kicking in so this is standard pretty normal anywhere you go so don't worry too much about it but if it's just a little bit noisy yeah using voice isolation the quality should be pretty much on par as just using standard so don't worry too much about it you can pick that so yeah i think that's all this is quick test for the you know front camera and yeah i guess i'll see you guys in the next video then bye